Hi everyone, and welcome back to Action Testing. Remember that video we made a while back on how to build a stunning indoor waterfall? Well, it exploded with almost 2 million views, and you guys had tons of questions. So we're back to answer those questions and walk you through the whole process again, step by step. Building the base. Let's start with the base. We'll need styrofoam sheets, easily found at hardware stores, which we'll glue together using a hot glue gun. Just check your closest bookshop or hardware shop for these sheets, or use packing used forms from electronics or other packaging. It creates a strong bond without any pesky water leaks. Now feel free to get creative with the design, but keep the basic structure in mind. Like this, like that. A hand like this, gently and perfectly. Why glue gun? Because it's easy and reliable than normal glue. If you don't have any, just buy one from a bookshop or a stationery shop for a few bucks. Building the top and finishing touches. Once the base is glued, it's time for the top part. We'll use the same method as before, and voila, our structure is complete. Now let's add some style. Like that straight, like that. Like that. Use a soldering iron or a heated nail if you don't have one to create holes for small PVC pipes, one at the top and one at the bottom. Seal everything up with glue and don't forget to make nine more holes on the top level for those beautiful water flows. And don't forget to make nine more holes on the top. Waterproof and durable with cement paste. Styrofoam is great, but it's not exactly waterproof or super durable. That's where cement paste comes in. Mix two parts cement with one part sand and add water until you get a paste consistency. Apply it in layers with a paintbrush, making sure not to block the pipes. Give it a few days to dry and harden, and you'll have a solid and stylish waterfall structure. Why use these small tubes? Well, for the smooth flow of water. Make sure small tubes are not blocked and clean before turn on.
pumping up the fun. Time for the water magic. Get yourself a DC mini water pump. Check online stores, they're pretty affordable. Place it in the base, connect the pipes, and cover it up with some decorative rocks. Don't forget to keep the water inlet open and the outlet connected to the vertical pipe. Remember, aquarium shops are your best friends for cheap rocks and artificial plants. Add some greenery to the top level, decorate with minimal flare, and fill the bottom with water. Power up and enjoy the flow. Connect the pump to a power source. An AC to DC phone charger works perfectly. Flip the switch and watch the water dance. It'll flow up to the top, cascade down the nine holes, and recirculate through the bottom again. Double check for leaks, and if you find any, just drain the water, dry everything, and reseal with glue and cement. Get creative and enjoy. That's it. You've built your own stunning indoor waterfall. Remember, this is just a basic model. Get creative and use your own ideas to design something unique and amazing. Now let's add some extra sparkle to our waterfall. Grab an LED strip, waterproof of course, and carefully install it at the bottom outside of the top part. Make sure it doesn't block the water flow through the base. Once it's in place, connect it to a power source. You can even use a battery pack for a completely wireless sieve. Adjust the light color and intensity to your liking, and voila! Your waterfall becomes an illuminated masterpiece. And hey, don't forget to subscribe for more awesome DIY projects like this. Cheers!